Silas or Silvanus, Greek, Silas Siluanos, Florida. First century AD was a leading member of the early Christian community, who accompanied Paul the Apostle on parts of his first and second missionary journeys. <laughs> Name and etymologies Silas is traditionally assumed to be the Silvanus mentioned in four epistles. Some translations, including the New International Version, call him Silas in the epistles. Paul, Silas and Timothy are listed as co-authors of the two letters to the Thessalonians. 2 Corinthians mentions Silas as having preached with Paul and Timothy to the church in Corinth 2 Corinthians 1 and Peter's first epistle regards Silas as a faithful brother 1 Peter 5 verse 12. There is some disagreement over the proper form of his name, he is consistently called Silas in Acts, but the Latin Silvanus, which means of the forest, is always used by Paul and in the first epistle of Peter, it may be that Silvanus is the Romanized version of the original Silas, or that Silas is the Greek nickname for Silvanus. Silas is thus often identified with Silvanus of the Seventy. Catholic theologian Joseph Fitzmier points out that Silas is the Greek version of the Aramaic, Sila", a version of the Hebrew, Saul", which is attested in Palmyrene inscriptions. <inaudible> <inaudible> Biblical narrative Silas is first mentioned in Acts chapter 15 verse 22, where he and Judas Barsabbas known often as Judas, were selected by the church elders to return with Paul and Barnabas to Antioch following the Jerusalem Council. Silas and Judas are mentioned as being leaders among the brothers, prophets and encouraging speakers. Silas was selected by Paul to accompany him on his second mission after Paul and Barnabas split over an argument involving Mark's participation. It was during the second mission that he and Paul were imprisoned briefly in Philippi, where an earthquake broke their chains and opened the prison door. Silas is thus sometimes depicted in art carrying broken chains. Acts 16 verses 25–37. According to Acts 17–18, Silas and Timothy traveled with Paul from Philippi to Thessalonica, where they were treated with hostility in the synagogues by some traditional Jews. The harassers followed the trio to Berea, threatening Paul's safety, and causing Paul to separate from Silas and Timothy. Paul traveled to Athens, and Silas and Timothy later joined him in Corinth. These events can be dated to around AD 50. The reference in Acts 18, verse 12 to proconsul Gallio helps ascertain this date. Cf. Gallio inscription. According to Acts 18, verses 6 7, Paul ceased to attend the synagogue in Corinth as a result of Jewish hostility, and it may be inferred that Silas and Timothy did likewise. Silas is not mentioned thereafter in the Acts narrative. Veneration <inaudible> 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 Saint Silas is celebrated in the calendar of saints of the Evangelical Lutheran Church in America and the Episcopal Church on January 26 with Timothy and the Titus, and separately on July 13 by the Roman Catholic Church and February 10 by the Lutheran Church Missouri Synod. See also Paul the Apostle Agabus Barnabas Menahan Teachings of Silvanus An apocryphal text that is attributed to Silvanus, Silas. Churches named after St. Silas References 